I think I've made some message about his disciples. I want to talk about Brother Joseph. There's no brother they call Brother Joseph. Brother Joseph. I think I've said it before, I'll say it again. Brother Joseph is meant, no now he has left due to issues after the passing on of President Joshua. Brother Joseph, normally the ministry and the calling God has given to him, he was meant to remain in the synagogue all the rest of his life. He will die there and they will bury him there. He's one of those that should have carried the church. Carry the church, live there to be pastor. But the producer now is in Mexico, if I'm not mistaken. But these are many errors and mistakes that have worked that have taken place because of the issue of uh, after his demise. You know, when the Lord said to a man, put your house in words, in order. Men don't understand this. Men. 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 The trouble you put great in this world after your demise, not be smart. Put your home in waiting in order. When God will call him, God will say, My son, put your house in order. God knows what to say. Because he knows that when you will depart, many problems will burst out. Because you know why? Because you men you are the head of the family. Hello? Let someone say, I am the head of the family. I am the head of the family. Men, talk to yourself. Say, I am the head of the family. I am the head of the family. That's so God don't work between husband and wife. You, the man, you are the what? You are the head. God is the chief head. Then you, the man, you are the head. Between your wife, you and your wife. So I want to beg men. This is what we say for men too. Please. Men always learn to put your house in order. So that there will be no crisis. There will be no crisis. So this is the issue with Brother Joseph. He's supposed to grow, stay in the synagogue, and be there till old age, and the church there is him. Then I want to talk about Sister Paula G and Sister Rose. If you, if you may not know, but they, these people, they, if they hear that message, they know. Sister Paula G and Sister Rose, please, actually Sister Rose, I want to beg you, because I see that uh, the world is calling you people. What I mean the world? You know what I mean the world? The world is calling you. That is, come and do the way people are what? And doing answer. Come and live life. I cannot go find, not go find man, set up myself. <laughs> Hallelujah. Oh, go find man, set up body. Not that God will not give you a man, a, a man as a husband, but you understand what I'm talking about. Please, the Lord is calling you people's attention to this area. Please, your master has passed up, but there is still hope. Don't turn to the other side and join the world. That is this normal thing that girls used to do. They become way work. Please, I want to beg you. Sister Rose, Sister Apology, they know their son. So this is the message. I'm sorry I have to bring this message on air. Because, uh, you know, there's so much uh, disarray among the Joshua's children. So I'm sorry, I will bring it on air as the Lord led me. So I want to beg you, stand firm in the Lord and don't let the world carry you away. Sister Rose and Sister Bola, they are disciples of Brazilian Joshua. And there's a brother they call Brad Benga. Brad Benga camera. You used to carry camera. You go with Brazilian Joshua, you carry camera. So I think with these names I'm calling, people should know that uh, I'm an insider. You know that, you know that I grew up with him. So, Brad Benga, you carried camera for TV Joshua. You have been with him. But I want to tell you that uh, you have a ministry. Like I know many of you are blind. So, as you mean, um, the man of God particularly did the right thing. I know many of you, you, you would have come to me and say, Okay, since Daddy said you are the next, okay, please, what do we do? So, nobody's directing you to me. So, Brad Benga, God has called you into the ministry. So, I want you to separate yourself. Separate yourself from God. Go and hear from God. Because God has called you into the ministry. So he has deposited something inside of you. That is Bragbenga Big. Bragbenga Camera. The big one. The big brother. That's there. So thank you. That is your message. 